Okay, this is one of those channeled readings where it's words, phrases, numbers that you can look up if you want, and some other things that might <coughs> uh, either strike a memory or an instance that will be relatable. Not every message is for you, so don't worry about that. Um, there's also some numbers that might not resonate for you right away. So, it's going to be interesting. There's also letters in here for some reason. I don't know. But we'll find out why. Okay, we have diamond. You will receive um, or give a precious gift. We have fan. We have romance. Celebration party. We have a ladder um, climbing towards success. We have a bull. We have do not back down from opposition. Show strength and fortitude. We have a tree. We have affairs with your family. Um, we have chair empty. We have somebody is leaving your life. We have a wall. We have misunderstanding. We have a dragon, um, beware of self-delusion. <coughs> we have December, that can be somebody's birthday or an event. We have a unicorn. We have, use your intuition to make a beneficial change. We have a vase. We have secret admirer. We have a frying pan. Trouble and assumptions. All right. So, like with my cold, I always get a <laughs> springtime cold because of allergies. <coughs> this is bad. Usually I don't have allergies this bad where, like, I get hives or whatever. But, um, yeah. I had to go to the hospital yesterday just so that they could give me my shot. But, um... It happens to the best of us. So, my throat's a little scratchy. My back hurts a little bit. Because that's where they jab me with the needle. But, um, other than that, it's pretty normal. Usually I do get a shot or I get Claritin or something. Or Benadryl for my allergies. But, yeah. It's tough during allergy season. So, yeah, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Anyway, um... Let's get into the reading, shall we? We have It Will n Never Be Boring. We have E16. We have 6-3. We have a, a D name. <coughs> so that could be like Daryl, David. You know, people's names like that. Or like Danielle. Dante. Whatever. Um, 52, um, there's a shirt, an alien, glass, eggy, um, we have slut twice here, we have father, we have mystery, cup, crystal, yacht, and we have 8,888. Um, you can look that up as an angel number two to find out if there's meaning there for you as well. We have desire. We have an iron. We have a boat. We have a tyrant. We have authority. We have um, the number 22. You can look that up as an angel number two. We have 7171. You can look that up as an angel number. See if that resonates for you. We have comedy. We have the number 2323. So find out what that is um, with the angel number method. Um, we have change style, the number 76. We have a barber. We have a wire or wine. We have snail. Um, share a thought for your partner's uh, for your partner's feet. That's like the feet or what they're good at, you know, and if they're kind of down or whatever. 
you must write an important letter to somebody. We have an easel. We have uh, D is for danger, a warning to be exactly or especially careful in the home or while traveling. We have can candle extinguisher. Those are those little caps that you put over candles or like those little figures that you put over candles. You know, those metal ones from like colonial days to extinguish a candle. Um, we have belonging. We have a maple tree. We have perfect timing. We have beads. Um, protection, female, always partying. We have the devil. We have intense feelings. We have scoop. We have problem, uh, pregnancy. We have a spider moving in together. Shepherd, control, street lamp. Something tangible. We have drama. We have lack of self-awareness. Uh, bitter, insecurity. Um, vanity bag. Planning for the future, beast, um, exercising your willpower, destruction, skill, um, birds of paradise, that's a flower, um, uh, breaks or days off, coconut, materialistic, a cler clergyman, um, determination, anonymity, which would be your being anonymous in a social situation. Um, good choices made. The Hasin flower or Hasin lily. Uh, working with friends. Dish. Ab ability to develop. Order. Haunted. Burger. Um, treason. Um, a stick of some kind. It could be a stick or a cane. Um, mutual feelings. Leopard. Hot pink. Legal matters. Child support. Combustion. Scanner. And we also have a hedgehog here. So, somebody is having a lot of things happen to them. They could also be influenced by other people. Um... They could also have a garden because it does have reference to a garden, and especially with the Hasin lily. The Hasin lily kind of looks like a mix between a gladius and a um, the pupil of Jack. The pupil of Jack kind of looks like one of those peace lilies, but they're bigger. Um, and um, the Hasin flower. In a lot of kind of uh, more tribal religions, um, use flowers and plants and stuff for <clears throat> for like rituals or for like harvesting and things like that. Um, usually, if it rains, a Hasin flower could be used for various things. Either for medicine, for the sick, <coughs> or to help somebody else find their way home. Um, it's a very interesting flower. Um, it kind of looks like a um, piece lily that's bigger, and it looks like almost like a compass. So, could be a lot of things that that could be used for. Anyway, hopefully this helps somebody out, and it gives you some type of message. Um, somebody could be going on vacation soon, or they could be going to a place where they've been before, um, which is kind of, kind of hard to describe. Um, but I, I believe it's not exactly like a place where you've gone, um, or lived as a kid. It's more of like, you're going to a place where it's kind of like a very niche type of vacation. Like, not too many people would go on this vacation. But it does have aspects of like a tropical vacation. It might not be the best vacation. It could be like, um, kind of like you have to work in order to <laughs> go on vacation. Which, if 
find is a little weird to describe that, but I feel like it's kind of like Aruba or like maybe the Philippines or Indonesia, um, where it's kind of like you kind of have to stay at a resort. It might be very limiting. You might not be able to sightsee. There might be limitations on what you can see um, due to either economic reasons or like gang reasons or something to that effect. There's some economical thing that limits the way you can explore. Um, but that's alright. I feel like you'll have fun anyway. But, um, yeah. Just be, just be aware of your surroundings. Because we do have iron. And we have change. So just be careful. Because that's a weird, <laughs> that's a weird thing. Um, just be aware of your surroundings. Okay? Anyway, I will see you in the next reading. Take care of yourself. Take care of everyone. And if you're going on vacation, be aware of surroundings. I understand you're on vacation. But there are aspects to the world where you might not understand. So just be just be aware of a, a particular area or a particular situation at around places where you may be visiting or going on vacation. All right, I think it will stop a lot of confusion, all right? Make educated uh, decisions. Um, anyway, I will see you in the next reading. Take care of yourself, take care of everyone. Uh, my black and white tuxedo cat just woke up. <laughs> You're so funny. All right, anyway, later.